The Thomas Trackmaster range produces some of the most detailed and accurate versions of the engines from the show you can find. Well, not including the model train products by Bachmann. Of course, however, like most ranges in the Thomas franchise, the motorized range is no stranger to cutting corners. This can include not painting details like lamps or buffers, or giving engines non-working side rods. So I've gone ahead and have given some of the engines in my collection the extra details that should have been added. These were very easy custom engines to make, so I decided to just do one big video to showcase them. My name is Railway, and today we'll be taking a look at my updated versions of the Trackmaster Bash, Dash, Porter, Stafford, Philip, Nia, and Young Bao. So, for most of the engines, I was only going to need to paint some smaller details. The only engine that was going to be given extra details was Philip. For some reason, Mattel didn't give Philip actual buffers. Instead, they gave him these tiny circles that are supposed to be buffers, but just look bad. So, I was going to have to add some nicer ones. With the designs in mind, I started work on the customs. Bash and Dash. These were really easy. All I did was paint the headlamps gold and painted the couplings. I prefer the Playrail ones more than the Trackmaster ones, but I'm not spending $200 for Bash and Dash the logging engines. Stafford. Painted the front and back lamp silver and repainted the handrails. I like the Trackmaster Stafford, but he is way too long. Porter. The front and back buffers were fully painted, and the headlamp was also painted. I like the Trackmaster Porter. Very good item. Philip. Philip took the most time as I added a few things to the engine. I painted the headlamp and tail lamp and added buffers to the front and back. These were from a Trackmaster Percy. I really like the Trackmaster Philip as he's in scale to the other engines. Nia. Painted the coupling hook, back buffers, and the stripes on the Westinghouse pump. I really like this version of Nia as there's so much detail on her, way better than the Playrail one. Young Bao. All I did was paint the little hat, I guess you would call it. Looks so much better. I like this one more than the Playrail one, but I don't like how short the tender is. Maybe I'll get the Playrail one and swap out the tenders. And that's all the engines, and we're onto the layout. Thank you. 